something I want to talk about now is vinyl records. Now I know a lot of you guys are into iTunes and downloading music illegally and YouTube and Twitter. You know, none of you have enough class to listen to vinyl records anymore. So what I want to talk about is why vinyl records are so awesome. I mean, what's better than lighting some candles, kicking back, like so, with some friends and a beer, and listening to some vinyl. Just have it play, man. The vinyl record, you don't get that compressed, digital, fake sound. This is the way that it was intended to be heard by the listener and by the artist. And that's why I want to tell you guys why vinyl is so awesome. So I have my collection here, and I want to go through some of them. The first one being Aerosmith, Night in the Ruts. Great album. 1979, last album with Joe Perry. If you don't have it, honestly, it's a great pick. Everyone kind of looks at Toys in the Attic and Rocks is the best stuff, but gold right here. Fleetwood Mac, Rumors. This is fantastic. Christy McVie, Stevie Nicks. Lindsay Buckingham, crucial purchase. Oh, I picked this guy up for $5 from Princeton Record Exchange. It's friggin' three vinyls. It's amazing. It's George Harrison. Beautiful music. All things must pass. Get it. Alright, a few more here. The Door is self-titled. Break on through. Soul Kitchen. Crystal Ship. Stoner's Dream. The police, Zenyatta Mandata. This might be shiny with the plastic thing, so I'm gonna take it off. Now it's a naked police, Zenyatta Mandata. And the best thing about this album is that it's straight up reggae. I mean, the police are such a good band, and they get known for this crap like fucking. You know what? I don't even care because they just suck. But I mean, this has got Don't Stand Too Close to Me, Don't Stand So Close to Me, Driven to Tears, Canary in a Coal Mine. Classic 1980 police album. Jesus Christ, this is harder than I thought. Meh. This is a band from Canada, Triumph, from Toronto. Kinda dubbed as a Rush copy band because they're a power trio and they're from Canada, but that doesn't mean shit. Their music is completely different, and if you ask me, they hold their own. Alright, this is my one gay pick. Alright, Duran Duran. I'm allowed to have it. Opeth, yes, progressive death metal, well written, it's so diverse, impeccable guitar lines, great drumming, there's not enough good things I could say, but I'd say about Opeth, this is Ghost Reveries, it's from 2005, fucking get it, I can't speak any more highly about this band, so good, and if you don't get it, you know, you're missing out, so that's your loss. Emerson Lincoln Palmer, first album, Knife Edge, not said. Van Halen 2, haha, <laughs> Joan Jett and the Blackhearts, The Runaways is coming out, go see that. Queen, Date the Races, I mean it's Queen. Michael Jackson Thriller, if you don't have this, then ask your next door neighbor, because everyone fucking has it. This acid trip of a cover is Axe is Bold as Love by Jimi Hendrix, great record. Our experience kind of overshadows all the other records, but in my opinion, this one's better, so get it. Another Joan Jet. I mean, if you don't have My Sharona on vinyl, you are just not as cool as I am. And The Pretenders. This is my parents. I don't know why I actually have this. I just wanted to share this with you. I found this in my mom's room. This artifact from the 90s. And her name is Cece Penis-Ton. CC penis ton. And the front of it says, Finally, it has happened to me right in front of my face, and I just cannot hide it. Okay, so now I'm actually going to put a vinyl record on for you because that is what this video is all about. For you to hear how awesome this is. And actually, ha, look at that. I have Aerosmith Night on the Ruts already queued up. Bam. Welcome. Panel open. Thank you so much. Oh shit. Fuck. <laughs> Didn't mean for that to happen. Fucking A. Feel that?
Vinyl Records. Gotta love them. So if you guys already have a vinyl record player, let me know about it in the comments below. Let me know what you like about it, what you don't like about it. If a friend has it, let me know what they think about it. What vinyl records do you have? What ones do you like? Don't you like? If you have any suggestions for me, if you want any suggestions about vinyl records to get, it's really cool and it's a really fun collector's thing. And just do it. So let me know what you guys think.